Hey everyone! <clears throat> so, today I'm just going to do like a little fun questions video. Um, yeah. It's the 17 random questions, and the tag goes by Juice. I didn't get tagged, but someone else did, and I got the questions off that blog. Um, it was someone got tagged by Juicy Star or Seven, and yeah. And I tag you guys. Why not? They are actually random questions. However, did you come up with them? But yeah, without further ado, enjoy the video and see you soon. Bye! Question 1. How did you get your YouTube username? Well, my nickname's just like a shortened version of Shannon because... My favourite actress, Shay Mitchell, her actual name was... Shannon Mitchell, um, I can't believe I forgot her last name, but she's on Pretty Little Lies, she plays Emily Fields. If you don't watch Pretty Little Lies, what is wrong with you? Um, but yeah, I just thought why not use that, and I, yeah. And Louise is my middle name anyway, and I just put hugs and kisses on the end. Because I give you all hugs, and... Kisses. Don't understand. Nope. Next question! I think this next question is just self explanatory. If you could change your name to anything, what would it be and why? I'm in a bit of. Well, it could be self explanatory, I really, but. I'd either, cha I'd either change it to Shay, it's already my nickname, but I'd officially change it to that. What else would I change it to? Elena, Elena from Vampire Diaries. Um, what else would I change it to? Aria, because you never really hear these names where I where where I live, and for me, Shannon's really well, not a really popular name, but it's quite a used name. I know at least. Three, if you could go back in time and give your younger self advice, what would it be and why? I would tell myself to stop eating so much junk food and so I can go back so I can be my size 10 slash 8 self and to stop getting distracted in school because I have a very short attention span. I'm surprised I've actually kept up with these videos because... I'm terrible with time management. I've got the brain of a squirrel. The minute I see, actually no, I've got the brain of the dog from Up. I'll talk about something, then I'll be looking around while I'm talking, and I'll get distracted and forget what I'm talking about. So yeah, that kind of um, speaks for itself. My eyes look incredibly blue today. Three. Oh no, four. What was I thinking? How old were you when you first learned to blow a bubblegum bubble? Can't blow one. Everyone's tried to teach me and I just can't do it. So I know how to blow it, you, I just can't do it. If anyone else has this problem, join my little club. I'm just kidding, I don't have a bubblegum blowing club. Don't take that serious. Five. What did you want to be when you were little? Um, this one was quite easy because when I was little I wanted to work with children because I was a child myself, literally. And now like, my perspectives have changed and I kind of want to start my own business. Keep You're doing this question. I think we're on question six and, my, six, six and my phone's just locked, so, well about me. What do you order at Starbucks? I've heard great things about Starbucks. I've never been. Well, I've always been past it and um, I've just never gone in because everyone always, oh, I always hear that it's really expensive but if I did go I'd get a pumpkin spice 
I'd either get a pumpkin spice latte or I would get the a chocolate mocha with two chocolate pumps and a pump of caramel. Yeah. It's because I have it elsewhere. I have that elsewhere and it is utterly delicious. What's the hardest you've ever laughed? This one might be quite a tricky one. Um, it's in all my classes, seriously. There's a lad in there is quite. All you have to do is all you have to do is, is just say something a bit stupid or comical to make us all laugh, and we all just sit there laughing. He's hilarious. Just cleaning up. Eight. If you could play any musical instrument, what would it be and why? Play the saxophone. I started the guitar in year seven and I quit after two lessons because the, the tutor that they currently were currently employing, he wasn't teaching me anything at all, and it was really annoying because I really wanted to learn the guitar. What else? My voice is my instrument. I sing a little. Um, but if I had to try a new instrument, I'd try. Hmm. I'm not quite sure. I think I'd try the cello. It just reminds me of a big guitar. It looks challenging. I meant all that challenging stuff. Yeah. Next question. Ten. What is your favourite movie? Well, um, I have quite a few. Don't know if you want me to name them all. I'll name my top five. Um, Divergent, The Hunger Games series, or what's what? Hunger Games slash Catching Fire. What's the other one? Oh, David! Oh, I've always said that. Uh, what else do I like to watch? Any Disney film whatsoever. Um, I think that's it. Oh, I'm blended. Adam Sandler is a genius. Or oh, and some of the Taken like sequels, because Liam Neeson is a top-notch actor. Uh, 11. What's one food you can't live without? Pizza. Don't tell anyone. Or, oh, and lasagna. My, my family call me Garfield. Well, my stepdad calls me Garfield. Whenever I have it, whenever we have it, because I always have everybody's extras. Well, everybody's leftovers, and... Why not? It's better not wasting it and it go in the bin. <laughs> and chocolate, probably chocolate. No, ice cream. Love ice cream. Thirteen. What's your favourite pizza topping? Chicken. Pineapple. Um, I would say ham. But I don't like ham on a pizza. So it's chicken and pineapple. Would you rather have the superpower to read minds or the superpower to be invisible? Well, that one's easy. I'd have the superpower to read minds. So then if you see a cute boy in your sight, then you can read the mind and see if they like it. You can go and ask them out. No, but yeah. And it would help you with question life. 15. What did you do for your last birthday? Let's see if I can recall it. What did I do? 
Oh, it was my 17th. I had some friends around and we had a drink and watched some films. I think. Why can't I remember my 17th? Uh, it was last year. I had like a buffet. Because I just remember that I was in my first year of college, so. I had a sleepover and we got drunk, kind of, and had a buffet. Wasn't that exciting, but you get what you pay for. And plus 17 is not exactly a big number to get excited all about. It's... But this year I'm 18. I don't know what I'm doing there. I think I'm having like a little pamper day with a few of my friends and then going for a few drinks at night. I'm not sure yet. Why is the camera being weird? I'm not sure yet, so if you have any ideas on what I can do for my 18th, put comments down below. Devs. But yeah. Uh. Sixteen, if you had one personal selfish wish, what would it be and why? If I had my own selfish wish, I'd wish to have a successful business and then I can have lots and lots of money. And I would be and then I would have like right contacts and things like that. And I'd probably, and, oh, or I'd wish for, like, a career in this youtube thing. Sort of like Bethany, Morta, Zoella, things like that, because, why not? No, but seriously, if you are thinking about having YouTube as a career, do go to college and get some sort of de uh, qualification in a subject that you might have as a backup and do a business because I can start my own business if all else fails. Last question of the day. What does OMGHHKP mean to you? Oh my god, happy, happy kid present. That's me. Yeah. I tag all of you guys and Zoella, I know she's not going to see this, but Zoella, Bethany, all the popular YouTubers, even though they're not going to see this video, and yeah. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, comment any video or ideas you have, and share the video with your friends, and I will see you later. Bye guys.